so this is just uh, an analogy that we are taking an example that we are taking to understand things in greater detail so let's start with an aggressor a1 and the switching activity of the a1 is 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 what we see see on the screen and due to this switching activity it contributes a bump of height 0.13 volts and and over here we are talking about all potentially unsafe glitches for example the glitches which have got a sufficient width we are talking about those glitches so, uh, so let's say uh, let's assume that the glitch width is sufficient enough so that it falls in the in, in, in the potentially unsafe area and the height will decide basically whether it's a, whether it's a potentially safe or unsafe glitch but but width wise we are good enough it it is a it is a potential glitch so let's look into the height wise and whether this particular bump will contribute or not but by the way we are not over with this because it's we have, we have talked only about a1 what about the remaining aggressors so let's take an example for them also so switching activity of a1 contributes a bump height of 0.13 volts and let's say switching activity of a2 contributes a bump height of 0.12 volts 